Brooklyn. Hello. How are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? The expo has been a lot of fun so far. Today starts the craziness, which is crazy, but it's also a lot of fun. It's when we get to meet the most uh, fans, and the majority of people are here, and it's nonstop, so it's it's a lot of fun. Um, but it's also very busy today. So what made you want to get into the Um, You know, I'd always sort of been a slut, always. So when I was looking for a new job a couple of years ago, I found um, an an ad on Craigslist. I don't know if I can say that. You know, and I thought maybe I could be a stripper, maybe do something like that. Um, but I found an ad for my former agent, and I gave them a call, and and I think I spent three hours in the meeting with them asking every question I could possibly come up with. Um, you know, and I felt like having sex was something I obviously love to do, and and that it sounded fun, and it is very fun. So what do you enjoy the most about it? I mean, getting paid to have sex really isn't a bad gig. Um, but it's also it's other things, a lot of flexibility in schedule. Um, you know, it, it affords you the opportunity to be home with your pets and your family a lot more, but still, you know, provide, go on vacations, go on trips and do stuff like that. Um, and really having fans, having people that are here right now to see me is just absolutely surreal. I never in a million years thought I would say I had fans. So just all in all, it's just the whole package is, it's crazy, um, but I'm enjoying every minute of it. Uh, who are the people you've enjoyed most working with? Um, one of my favorite guys to work with would be Johnny Castle. I love Johnny, I love Bill Bailey, um, I love Mandingo, a lot of, yeah, I do a lot of interracial stuff, and so I, really, there's no one that I have left a scene with and said I don't ever want to work with them again. That's never happened. Um, which is another huge benefit of it is that everybody's really cool and, and like-minded and down to earth and gets along and we're just very dysfunctional little family. So, um, but Castle's, Castle's my favorite guy. He's my favorite. Is there anything that surprised you about the porn industry when you got it? Honestly, how comfortable it is. Um, I also came in under the impression that I could somehow hide this from everyone that I knew and that no one I knew would find out that I was doing porn um, and I was very surprised that lasted an entire month. So I was a little shocked when that first phone call came in. Um, but otherwise, just everyone's so fun and cool and it's, it's very comfortable, you know, and I think when you're in a place where you have to get, you know, undressed in front of complete strangers and um, you have to be comfortable and that's one of the things that surprised me most on my first shoot. It's just how easy it is and how, how, how comfortable. When you said it took about a month for people to find out, how did it feel when people found out you were doing Luckily, I have an extremely loving family <laughs> and a very close group of friends, um, which is really all that I care about. You know, the, the people from high school, whatever. Um, not that I don't like you high school people, but uh, you know, but my friends, you know, my friends and my family were all just, you know, told me that they loved me and it didn't matter what I did, that they loved me and, um, you know, and, and I'm fortunate that this year at AVN I have a group of, I don't know, 10 friends here with me, you know, going to the parties with me and walking around the expo and doing things. So my friends and family both have been very receptive and, and very loving. Excited for AVN Awards tomorrow? I am. I have a couple nominations that I'm hoping for, obviously, but just to be nominated is, again, not something I would ever have expected. Um, but I am nominated for Best Actress for Wicked Pictures, a movie called Odd Jobs. Uh, and I'm also nominated for a Best Boy, Boy, Girl threesome for Elegant Angel, um, as well as Best Boobs, which is the one I really, really want. Um, not only because it's a fan voted award, but I like my boobs. And other people liking my boobs makes me happy. I like my boobs too. Well, thank you. Um, what's your favorite type of scene to shoot? Uh, my favorite types of scenes are either girl, girl, because I really don't get to do a whole lot of that. And so that's always, I still get nervous before a girl, girl scene. I also really like any scene. I like any scene, but I like any scene with multiple guys. So when there's more than one guy, those are my favorite scenes because I really just like to be sort of thrown around and manhandled and, and just kind of pushed places and, and that turns me on. So anything with 
you know, boy, boy, girl, boy, 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 girl, gang bangs, any of that kind of thing are, are some of my favorites to show. What's the most amount of guys you shot with? Eleven. Whoa. I did an... It was good. I did a... Um, I did an 11 man interracial gangbang for dogfart.com, our uh, dogfart network. And um, I love them over at dogfart. So it's always fun working there. But yeah, 11, 11 black guys. That's, that, that's my limits or my, my max so far. What do you like to do in your spare time? In my spare time, I'm extremely boring. I do a lot of crafting. I like to glitter things, I like to be a dazzle things, I like to make wreaths door reads, those are sort of my specialty. Um, I also like to throw parties. I have like a baby shower and a wedding shower and a bachelor. I've got a whole list of parties that I'm throwing this year because um, I love party planning. Other than that, I just kind of chill. I, you know, have a glass of wine, read a book, and go to sleep at 10. All right. uh, what does a guy have to do to get your attention? As cliche as it is, the thing I like most in a guy is a sense of humor. Um, because I think I really don't think looks matter because if you care enough about somebody, it's irrelevant. They're the most attractive person in the world to you, you know, when you care about them. So uh, a good personality, someone that treats me well, and it's, it's funny is my top of my list. Any final words? I just want to say thank you to everybody that supports me and watches my movies. Um, today, I think, is the last day to vote for Best Boobs, so get on that. And um, thank you. I appreciate every one of you. Thanks.